Hi, my name's Helen and this is my channel, Helen Mary Jo. If you're new here, then welcome. If you're returning, thank you. And if you're a member of Hell's Bells, that's a double thank you. Um, Hell's Bells is just a little name that I've given to the ladies that watch regularly. My daughter came up with it and uh, it's just quite cute, really. It's just a bit of fun. So if you haven't subscribed, then I really would ask you to consider doing that. It doesn't cost you anything and um, it determines kind of how my channel gets um, kind of advertised by YouTube, I guess, really. So anyway, today I have got, I'd say, a huge haul from Wallace. And uh, somebody said, oh, have you looked at Wallace? And, and I have. I've done Wallace before. But um, so I thought, well, I'll have another look. Uh, last time I did, um, do you remember, I did, what was it, a bright pink suit, I think, and a couple of dresses. Now, this is all knitwear. I think I've got eight or nine pieces to show you. And it's so mild today. Again, thank goodness we're getting away with the heating. Um, <laughs> it's a funny thing on Friday. You know, those smart meters are a blessing and a curse, aren't they? Because I, um, I try not to look at it. But I do look at it and I'm like, oh, my goodness, you know, how much today? And uh, and then the other part of me goes, like, what am I doing? You know, we worked hard to not have to worry about bills and things. And I've got quite a lot of credit at the moment. Plus, I was lucky enough to fix my tariff early. But still, you know, the whole country is obsessed with heating costs. So anyway, I said to Rob, what's that? It's 17.59. And he said, that's the time. <laughs> I had to laugh. I really, oh, that was the God's honest truth. I thought suddenly we'd spent £17.59p in one day and I hadn't even had any equipment running. So, um, yes, I am wearing what I'm also wearing when I make the Christmas cake because um, I'm doing it on the same day, basically. And uh, so I've done the Christmas cake. I've just got that cooking. And um, that is cooking in the slow cooker to avoid putting the oven on, contrary to what I've just said about not worrying about it too much. Um, it's interesting. I just thought it's worth a go because I've made bread in the slow cooker before. And it's kind of the same principle, isn't it? Slow cooking. So um, fingers crossed that, that turns out all right. So I've also done an eyebrow tinting video. Uh, this morning in the same blouse. So, um, yeah, you'll be thinking I'm wearing the same thing every day. I'm not. I'm just filming on the same day, just trying to, to get some in the bag, so to speak. So, um, yeah, that's about it, really. I, I probably won't, unless I see something, I've got this haul and I've got, um, I'm going to uh, put my teeth in straight. I've got an M&S haul um, that I will... I think that's kind of party wear. And I think that's probably it, really, because I think most of us have bought what we what we want now. And, um, oh, I would mention on Money Saving Expert, and if you saw my video about saving money, I really, really, really respect and admire Martin Lewis, who's the Money Saving Expert. And I follow his page, and it was because of him that I fixed my electricity tariff which made it more expensive at the time, but it saved me, brought me down. I'm under the government cap um, allowance, so that's great. And um, anyway, why was I saying that? I forgot. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know. There's a deals predictor on his page, and um, it tells you the big stores and online too, when they – reduced things or ran offers last year right through from now right through till Christmas so depends on you know if you need to get things ahead of time for gifts or you can afford to hang on or you don't need a specific specific item um, and obviously we've got Black Friday coming up when's that that's next week isn't it yeah the last Thursday in November gosh it's galloping away isn't it anyway I'll stop rambling on um I usually chat too much I just do and uh, I'll I'll get the first um, item on. I hope there's a couple of nice ones in there. I ended up, I did buy the Sosander 
uh, sweater with the gold bow that had a, a slight more of a bone, a boat neck rather than the high neck. So I've got that one. That's kind of my Christmas sweater for this year. And loads of people asked me about the snow one that I wore in the cooking video. Um, and that is a few years old because obviously you only wear them about two or three times every year, don't you? And then shove it away in the drawer and it's kind of not too in your face. Anyway, Helen, stop talking. Get on with the trying. And uh, let's get on with the next haul in my haul. <laughs> See you uh, in, a, in a minute. Thanks. This is the first jumper that I'm trying on. And um, when I bought it, there was 20% off and another 10% off. And at the moment, it is on at £36. And that's with the 20% off. But they are still reducing things at Wallace. So I'll try and get the, uh, this up quickly. I love the design. There's nothing on the back, which is different to the um, So Sander one. And this one is not as nice a fabric, I have to say. It is cheaper, but it feels cheaper, that's the truth. But it's perfectly acceptable. It's not at all itchy. And it's made from, it's a nightmare now with these websites because when I look at the order, it, um, it just says free. Well, I know they weren't free, so I've got to, and you can't even click on it. I have to copy and paste it into the search uh, bar and then find it so it's a bit of a painful task but it's 70 percent acrylic and then it's nylon elastane it's machine washable but it's nice enough um it's more um the sander one is more um a much finer knit you know a cooler jumper i think this would be quite a warm sweater i will say jumper and i know the americans in my audience and Canadians, they don't really say jumper, they say sweater. But it's pretty, isn't it? It's sparkling nicely under the lights, and they do it in two other colours. I think they do it in, let me see, they do it in, oh my goodness, they do it in a black with a red sequin and an ivory with a silver sequin. So that's number one. And uh, as I say, I think it was £36 discounted price. So th this one is actually out of stock in the extra large, which is what I bought in. Um, but I still don't like it as much as the So Sandra one. So I'm happy with that. But like I say, it's perfectly fine. And um, if it's your cup of tea, then fine and dandy. I mean, you know, it's not a jumper that you're going to be wearing lots, but you can kind of see the texture there. Whereas the So Sander one is much finer knit and kind of more comfortable to wear if you want to wear it on Christmas Day or whatever. So that's number one. Number two, I love I love the flowers on this sweater. Um, again, it's plain at the back and it's got the higher neck and it is very soft and it's got kind of almost, it's kind of got quite a full sleeve, you can see there. Um, and a a longish cuff. It's a similar fabric. I personally would rather spend another £10 and have a better knit. I think, I think it's a shame to spend the money that they have to spend on the sequins to then choose a cheaper fabric. But that, that's just my opinion. Let's see. I got this in extra large as well. And currently, it's got 40% off. So it's £35.40 at today's price, and it was £59. So it's a good price, 30, yeah, £35.40. And again, it's acrylic nylon elastane. It feels very similar, but it feels, because it's high, it's, um, you know, I think it would be kind of, you know, if you were going ice skating with the family or going for a walk or something, but you'd want something underneath that when you got home, you could possibly take this off because, you know, it all seems to be mild at Christmas time in this country. So but I like it and it's a good length. It's sort of just about, it's long enough, covers my tummy and sort of comes down to my crutch, really. I'm five foot six, size 18. But I think it's a very, I think it looks really nice. Um... I just wish it was just a slightly higher quality fabric. 
but I don't know what you think. I keep my, I, I'm not trying to take off. I'm just showing you how the, the flowers are placed on it. So, uh, yeah, that's number two. This is number three, and this one is navy blue with a kind of um, bronzy copper sequin. Oh, sorry, the microphone's there. It's too high up here. I keep knocking it. Um, it's as, called a zebra print. And although this, again, is um, acrylic polyester and nylon, it's got a much finer feel to it. You can see it's a much finer, finer knit. And also, I don't think it's kind of too Christmassy. You know, I think you could wear this after Christmas. It's navy blue with this lovely, I think this is lovely. And this one was, this is down, this is 50% off. This is £32.50. I mean, I've kept the black trousers on. There's a limit to how many times I'm going to change. But, um, and I think you can wear blue with black nowadays. I know it used to be a no-no. But it's a good length, it's comfortable. And I think that's a lovely buy for £32.50. It's, again, got that quite wide sleeve. Um, but it doesn't feel, it's a much finer knit, a much finer fabric. And um, it's, yeah, I think it's really lovely, actually. This is my favourite so far because it hasn't got that, that kind of cheap feel to it. Sorry, Wallace, but, uh, you know, that's, that's why I do this, to be honest. And, uh, yeah, I think that's lovely. It's changed from black as well doesn't it it's less harsh on your face to have the blue um and it's not not too high I, i'm not finding that high at all it's not it's not arguing with my wattle right number three number four now i love this i've got to say i really really love it it's um a fine fabric it's very, very similar to the um so sandra one it, it's a it's a nice fine fabric it's viscose rayon it's oh it's just viscose and rayon and it's uh, reduced to 5850 and it you know the girl in the photographs got it on with like she's slimmy slimmy min, min, mini mini person and she's got tiny little lovely slim legs with like um leather leggings on i haven't I've got my legs and on her you know she's got it the tunic but it is, it is a good length and uh, I would wear it with um tighter fitting trousers if necessary I think it looks all right with this done though but I I don't know I think it looks really well you know oh, I think it looks quite sexy now somebody will probably tell me that I'm far too old to be sexy but you know what I'm not going to say, um, but uh, and I've got the pearl earrings, which obviously I would wear gold earrings. You know the ones I showed in the Meneer, uh, the two gold. I want those now, the two gold ovals. And um, I think I said before, if you saw it on the uh, Meneer site, now there's a heading that says Helen Mary Jo, so you can find everything there. But I think they would look fab with this, especially if you put hair up and you've got that there. Don't you think that looks nice? Oh, I don't need it, but I really like it. Oh, fiddlesticks. Do I prefer this to the So Sander one? Oh, honestly, why do I do this to myself? Anyway, this is in the extra large, and uh, I think it's, well, it's obvious what I think, isn't it? Because I'm loving it, and... Uh, I think be really useful and again nowadays sequins aren't just for Christmas are they no what I'll do is I'll show my daughter and see what she thinks but I really really like it like yeah, you know I really like it I'll shut up now right that's uh what was that number I've lost track four four five anyway it's my favourite so far by a country mile. I've, I've lost count now, so whatever one this is. But this Is this six? Anyway, it's this one. The pearl, scattered pearl. And this, again, is the light, nice fine knit. And this one 
is reduced to 35.40. Um, it's a good length. I got it in the extra large. They're all they're all a good length to be fair. It, they come to here and they, there's plenty of room in them. And this one doesn't feel too hot. Now uh, my misgivings with this is that um, you'll lose pearls when you wash wash it. I think uh, it's quite vulnerable. I like it, but not that much. And this is just me being bonkers. But it kind of reminds me of a science lab. You know when they um, put like DNA things together or genomes or whatever it is they do, these clever people, and uh, or kind of like smallpox or acne, but um, I don't know. I mean, I do like it. I, I really do like it, but I think that you would lose pearls. And um, for that reason, I wouldn't buy it. But um, it's nice. It's a good height. I've got this just right, actually, because it doesn't fight with my neck. And um, it's a lovely fabric, just like the Sosandra one. Very similar. And uh, how does it say to wash it? I mean, if I was going to wash it, I would definitely wash this by hand. Um, what does it say? God, every language under the sun. Uh, do not tumble dry, obviously. 40 in the wash. So, yeah, it's a personal thing, isn't it? I think, I mean, I think it's really classy. And, you know, that would look really nice with a straight, um, pleather skirt wouldn't it or you know straight like well wide leg trousers I mean I really I really think it's very smart very nice and um it does go better with my pearl earrings than the last one so hope you like it this is I think this is the final black jumper I think sweater um, and this one's different in as much as it's got the gems are stuck on they aren't sequins sewn on or pearls fastened on these are little gems stuck on which does make them vulnerable but um, they call this the black cable embellished high neck jumper again in extra large they're all extra large and this is made from viscose polyamide viscose and polyamide um is it washable It is washable. It says it's machine washable. I wouldn't put this in the machine personally. And uh, it's shorter than the others. The neck is lovely. I mean, I think it's it's nice. It's not my cup of tea. It's too short for me. It, it sort of just sits here, which is not quite long enough. I've got a vest top underneath, so that's what you can see at the edge there. But if I um, pull it down, it's just not quite long enough for me i'm five foot six and obviously i take it up with my boobs and stuff if you're slimmer it'll be longer um and do you know what it reminds me of a little bit like a uniform you know like having those stripes on the sleeves i don't think they really add anything to it at all it's like they just thought oh let's stick some more on um but you know you might love it it's all personal taste at the end of the day. My taste is no more relevant than your taste. I just say what I like and, you know, you know what you like. Um, and it's nice, the reflection, you know, that's always a good thing. Um, but, yeah, it's not for me. But there's kind of nothing wrong with it as a choice, but it's just not for me. And there's ones I prefer, which has been quite obvious from my reaction. So I thought I'd ring the changes with a berry colour instead of the all the black and the navy and then I, I think I've got one kind of creamy colour one that I think I just saw in there and I know this sounds ridiculous but this is kind of a bit more low key like I could I would have worn this to the office in the week leading up to Christmas um it doesn't feel quite so blinktastic obviously it's a Christmas tree and I'll link everything below and this one is the same nice knit these are all the same kind of knit as uh, the Sosanda one. And this one is got just 10% off and it's £40.50p. And it is made from viscose and nylon. nylon. 
and it's machine washable. It's um, long enough, just about long enough, just covers my foof and um, it's kind of halfway down my, well, more than halfway down my backside. And obviously it's Christmas tree decoration, but you see what I mean? It's not, it's kind of low key. So I, I, I don't know how I can say low key and sequins in the same sentence, but um, it's, it's nice. It's got kind of, you can see there's a very, very, I don't know if it'll pick up on the camera. There's a very, very fine line of machining. I don't think you can see that, that um, these little sequins are on. So it's like the tree's been decorated. And um, I don't know if they do this in other colours. Let me see. No, I don't think they do. But, you know, if you want to change them with a nice berry lipstick and gold earrings, I, I think it would look very nice. A lot of ladies I know won't wear black. It's got a nice neckline and is machine washable too. And again, I think it's a bit like the one I had, the silver grey snow one I had on. I think that you would have this in your wardrobe for years and get it out every Christmas. So if you're in the market for a new Christmas jumper, sweater, then um, crack on. I think, yeah, these are all, these are stitched on. No, they're glued on too. These sequins are glued on as well. I think you have to be really careful. In my experience, anything that's glued on is a little bit um, sensitive to washing. But um, yeah, it's perfectly nice. As I put this on, I thought, oh, I don't like this. And then I looked in the mirror and I thought, I do like this. So it just shows you, you do really have to try things on. And I tell you why I like it. It's because I think it's a very, very um, flattering colour. This kind of, it's like the palest blush pink. What do they call it? Ivory, they call it. But it's definitely got a pink hue to it. It's more the fluffy kind of fabric. I'm sure it's man-made as well. It's acrylic, nylon and polyester. It's machine washable. I love it when they say the model's wearing a small and it's still big on her. Oh, well, never mind. And uh, it's got these very ornate flowers. And these are all, st oh no, they're stitched on. No, they're, no, yeah, they're stitched on. So uh, let me show you the full length. It's a good length. I'll tuck the best stuff up. It comes down long enough for me, but not too long. You know, it's not tunic at all. It is a sweater. And this one, everything's extra large. Like I keep saying, I'm five foot six, size 18. And this has got 10% off. I would have got 20% off plus 10%. So I would have paid less for it. Um, and it was 59 and it's currently £53.10p. I think it's a lovely alternative to black or navy. You know, it's it's... If you're very pale, well, I don't know, is this good colour if you're pale? But, you know, it won't drain you, what I'm saying. It kind of lifts your face. So, um, yeah, I like it. I'm not buying it, but I do like it because, I mean, there really is a limit to how much of this stuff I need. Somebody asked me where I stored it all the other day. Can you imagine if I kept all this? I mean, I like that, the way that cascades down there. And it's different, you know, every part of it has got a different kind of design. I think it's really nice. Nice. That's not a good word, is it? I think it's a very attractive jumper. The very last, <coughs> excuse me, the very last thing I'm showing you is not blingy. No bling. All the ladies that hate sequins will be relieved if they've, they've probably turned off by now. But um, this is called a long line star jumper and this is reduced currently to 38 pounds 50 and it was 55 pounds and it's still in stock in all the sizes and it is made from acrylic polyester and elastane and it is kind of that fluffy you know it's quite it's quite thick and warm actually i do like it i'll show you the full length it's plenty big enough it's not pulling on me at all it's got nice pockets it's a good length Really nice, um, you know, to go shopping, like if you had a shirt and jeans, I think this would look really classy. The sleeves are quite long, but there's plenty of room in it. I'm quite tempted by this, I, I must admit. Um, 
I like it a lot. And that's all I can say about it, really. Um, so that's all of the haul in my haul for today. I've got a new little catchphrase. I obviously like a catchphrase, don't I? I did like Bruce Forsyth, so I guess forget that nonsense. Um, yeah, so um, what was I going to say to you? Oh, yeah, in the um, which video? The Primark mini haul video. Um, I asked a question about um, the website that I've got that's not live at the moment, actually. So Casey, my daughter, who I started, the, it's kind of a shop that sells, a little online shop that we started just before lockdown. And um, it's it's completely down to me. I didn't work to to sort it out, to get it organised. And um, as a consequence, we didn't really do anything with it. Occasionally, we got a random order, which we could never quite understand how uh, how people happened upon it. But um, so we just need to get sorted and hopefully that'll go live next week. And obviously, I'll show you and um, talk about it. And, you know, it's totally up to you what you do or don't do with it. Um, and um what else so i've done i've done my eyebrow they, they've got darker as the day's gone on actually but my eyebrows are dark you know somebody said you you make your eyebrows too dark my eyebrows are dark I don't, <laughs> I don't know what i'm supposed to do sometimes honestly um and so i've done that and i've done my christmas cake one and i've got a marks and spencer one to do and then I've got my own website one to do. I've got, um, oh, I've got so many things in the pipeline. It's honestly, it's turned into more than a part-time job, which I'm not complaining about. I really enjoy it. And I love the fact that you are watching. And I hope you enjoy it too. And I know I don't spend long on each item, but I don't think I need to. I was watching a vlogger the other day. And I won't name any names, but she only tried on three things. And she spent 12 minutes on each thing. I couldn't do that if my life depended on it. I mean, I, once you know the fabric, you know the price, you know what it looks like on me. I don't really know what else I'm supposed to say. And, you know, if you're tempted, then just order it and have a look at for yourself is what I would say. Um, but anyway, each to their own. I mean, she's a really lovely lady. And don't, don't get me wrong, I, I just, I thought, crumbs I only spend about two three minutes on each item but um anyway that's me for today I'll try and get this uploaded I might even get this up for tomorrow morning and um yeah <laughs> thank you so much for watching it means the world and I'll see you really soon thank you bye <laughs>